In this video, I'm going to show you how to produce sounds with MIDI patches in Harrison Mixbus 32C version 8. As you choose a MIDI file, the sound will be auditioned by what is selected down here at the bottom. You can see we have the general MIDI synth called up. So as I play this drum groove, it happens to already be on channel 10, which are what drums are set to by default. If you want to change the sound that is being auditioned, all we have to do is hit the button down here to show the GUI. So channel 10 is set to standard, but if we click on that, we can choose anything from standard drums to dance drums, 808s, power, and room. Let's see what this would sound like with electronic sound. Once you've chosen the sound that you like, as we drag this in, that sound is now retained as we drag it into a slot. but this doesn't mean that we still can't change the sound after the fact. So if we select that clip, we can see here on the bottom, the MIDI patches, and now we have a dialog box that pops up. Let's try 808. And we can even change the sound as it's playing. This also means we can have two different sounds on the same track. And we can also change the sound after the fact. Now that I've shown you how to change the sounds, let's go ahead and make a little song. So I've been playing around with these raw MIDI drums and I really like the techno beat. So this gives me a four on the floor kind of sound. And if I want, I can still go back and change the sound after the fact. Let's make this an 808. And let's add a little bit of EQ. Okay, let's add this snare in here. Let's have it be a different sound as well. Let's make it a dance snare. Now I can either hit QA or the F1 key to start both of these at the same time. Okay, very cool. And just for fun, let's go ahead and add in a plugin. This is the 3D triple delay. And let's just pull back the wet and give it a little bit of echo. And let's go up and choose some piano chords. Right, let's play the key of F. And let's choose a major progression. Now for the piano, I can have this be auditioned by pretty much any sound. Currently it's just a standard piano. But I can go in and choose pretty much anything I want. So here's a rock organ. Or let's just choose a warm pad. And when I drag this in, it'll retain that sound as it goes into the slot. And now let's play the whole row. And now for jamming purposes, let's play a little bit of guitar. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe down below and click the bell so you'll be notified the next time we release videos in this series. Until next time, I'm Nathan from Harrison Consoles and I'll see you in the next video.